All right, so let's get into it. Who is the first teacher that we have talking about their mom? Teacher it says, Sam. It's Sam. <laughs> okay, good old Sam. What does Sam say、mm-hmm. about his mom? What's one of the best things he learned from his mom? Sam says, "My mother said you should be forgiving. That's a, that's a good thing to be forgiving. Absolutely."、Mm. And I guess maybe Sam made a lot of mistakes and did silly stuff, <laughs> and his mom yes, still、Sam. loved him. So that was maybe how he learned to be forgiving. But it's、Aww. a good thing to be. Okay, so you know, Sam 的妈妈就是小时候可能跟 Sam 小 Sam 说，哎，你应该要有怎么样 ？You should be forgiving，、mm. 有颗宽容的心。其中的 forgiving， 我们用一道 forgive 这个动词，就是原谅，对不对？所以 forgiving 是个形容词，就是宽容的 forgive。And forget, or forget、ah, and forgive. Whatever. That's right. Absolutely. Yeah, that's and, very important. And here's a good reason to be forgiving. As、mm. Sam continues, he says, "Life is easier when you stop thinking about people's mistakes." Right.、Oh. So you you'll have a much easier, happier, more comfortable life if you don't think too much about other people's mistakes. Yes, other people might do silly things. It might hurt you in some way. But if、mm. you always think about it, if you're like, "Oh, what that guy did to me." <laughs> Oh, I'm never gonna forgive him. And oh, he still makes、uh, me mad. It happened a year ago, but I'm still angry.、Gorgeous. You're just gonna be an angry person, and the other person might not even know why you're angry. Someone, <laughs> someone told me that if you're angry like that, you're、oh, giving、yeah. that person a lot of power. The power、oh, to make you unhappy. Really?、Like、you shouldn't give that power to people. What if I have a really good、people. memory? I just happen to remember all these things. It's okay to remember it, but not to carry that feeling、oh. around. Because just carrying it is just making you angry, and it's not really bothering them. They might、That's、not even、true. know why you're、They、angry. Don't care、so、really? Be forgiving, and it's much easier. That's a good point. 大家一定要跟这个 Sam 的妈妈还有 Mike 老师学习，因为当你啊要停止去执着于别人的过错的时候，你的生活不但会轻。重点还有麦克老师还补充，就是说，其实呢，他有一个另外的想法，就是当你很讨厌这个人，然后你有一些负能量，你反而是加重那个人的 power， 就是可以让这个，而且他可能根本就不在意，他根本就不知道你多么讨厌他，所以为什么要跟自己过不去，好不好 ？OK， mistake， let's take a look at this word。OK， it's a noun and it basically is spelled M I S T A K E， mistake， M I S T A K E， nice and simple。A mistake is a noun, and it's something that you do that is basically wrong. Okay, you can make a mistake on your math exam when you write down the wrong answer. That's a mistake. But we can also make mistakes in our lives by treating people badly or saying the wrong thing to someone. Often, when you make a mistake, either right after you make the mistake or later on when you learn about it, you want to change it. You kind of wish you had a time machine. You could travel back in time and fix that mistake, fix that thing that you did badly or you did wrong. For example, Jane will not get better at her job because she never learns from her mistakes. Jane will not get better at her job because she never learns from her mistakes. Hmm, that's a that's a good point. We all make、mm. mistakes, but we should try to learn from them and try not to make the same mistake two times or three times、yeah. or more than once. It's like when speaking English too. It's、mm-hmm. okay, to, it's make okay mistakes, to make mistakes, but remember,、yeah. like you know, learn from them. Yeah, learn from them, and next time just yeah improve. Nobody's perfect. That's right. Co-、uh, mistake. I was going to say correct. Mistake 其实就是过失、错误的意思。像是刚刚的例句提到，就是 Jane 在工作上。永远不会进步，为什么呢？因为呢，嗯，他从来不会从错误中学习。那其实最重要的就是，我们可以犯错，但是一定要 learn from your mistakes. Hmm. All right. Here's another teacher, and it's a lovely Tiffany. Tiffany. Hi, Tiffany. Best friend in the whole world. What does your BFF? What、yeah. does Tiffany say about her mom? Tiffany says, "My mother inspires me to be a strong woman."、So、my mother inspires. So she has to like go to the gym and something like no, that. No, <laughs> no. Tiffany isn't exactly you know large、uh, in the muscle、uh, department, but she's large in the personality、uh, and the inner strength department. That's what she means here by being a strong woman. She can't lift a car, but she can get through troubles in life and still be a good person. Oh, okay. So her mom, Tiffany, mom is inspiring her to be a more strong woman. OK， 这里呢，我就提到了刚刚，我就想说，每一个位妈妈其实都一定会
怎么样会激励每一个小孩子。所以我刚刚就用到了 inspire 这个动词。然后现在我们也来看一下 inspire。Maybe I made a mistake just now. Maybe Tiffany can lift a car. I've never asked her. Maybe she is an amazingly strong woman. Yeah, maybe woman. she's like a super woman. I think woman. We, when we say strong, we mean it's more <laughs>、uh, about a personality. And strong people like that can definitely inspire you. Inspire. It's a verb. It's spelled I N S P I R E. Inspire. You are inspiring many people to go and lift weights because of your giant muscles. Biceps. Yeah. No, I don't have. They're not. They're not that giant. No. no. To inspire, this verb basically means to give someone a lot of hope and courage, to make them feel like they can do something. They're ready to do something, and they want to do something. Often, when we have heroes in our lives, people who've done great things, and we go, "Oh, I wish I could do that." And maybe if I work hard like that guy or like that woman, I can be great too. That's what we're talking about by inspiring someone. It's similar to the word to encourage, but encourage might be more direct. Like you can do it, go for it. I know you're good enough to be successful. But inspire might be more almost like a dream, maybe from someone you don't know, someone you admire in history or in the world right now. But they're giving you that sort of feeling of a little bit of an extra push, a little bit of a magic power that makes you think, I can do this. I am going to do this. For example, the teacher inspired his students to follow their dreams. The teacher inspired his students to follow their dreams. Inspire. Inspire. Okay, 就是激励啊，或是鼓舞。它是个动词哦，所以它的动词三态是 inspire, inspired, 直接接地 inspired. If you watch a lot of TED talks. A lot of、mm, those these speeches、talks. can inspire a lot、Absolutely. of people.、Yeah. 其实有很多在网络上的演讲，像在 TED Talk， 大家不妨可以看看，因为它可以激励你很多方面的思考。哎，就像刚刚我们的例句有提到的，有关一位老师，他鼓励他的学生们要怎么样去追求梦想 ，follow their dreams. Right. So Tiffany was inspired by her mom to be、mm-hmm. a strong woman, and here's another good thing she learned from her mom. It says she taught me to work. Hard. She taught her to work hard. Right. Nothing in life is given to you for free. <laughs> That's true. You have to work for it and work hard. And the harder you work, the better your chances of being successful. Yeah. Okay. So, 没错，其实这个没有天下没有白吃的午餐，应该中文这样讲是对的。就是你不可能坐在那边说我不想要干嘛，我就可以有收获。因为 Tiffany 妈妈她教导她说，一定要怎么样努力工作，这样才会有好的收获哦。Okay. Here's my. Here's my mom. I have someone here named Laura. Who was Laura? <laughs> It's me. It's oh, Laura! Me. Of course, I knew it was you. <laughs> I'm just teasing.、Laura. Now, what does Laura or Laura say about her? <laughs> What's your mom's name? What's her first name? Stephanie. Stephanie. Okay. What does mom's、uh, Laura say about her mom, Stephanie? That's a lovely name.、Yeah. It's a really nice name.、Mm. Anyways, Laura says, "When I feel lost, my mom always says, 'Smile and be happy.'" She doesn't、okay. say you should turn left here and go right there. And oh, lost in life, not lost in the city. That's right. I was like, your mom should just send you a GPS map. It's like, or something. go check out Google Map and smile. Exactly. And That's right. Find a taxi and tell them where、Bye、you live.、Cool. No, when we're talking about lost here, we're not talking about I'm lost. I don't know where I am. We're talking about what do I do with my life? I don't know how to sort of go forward in the best way possible. Should I do this? Should I do that? Oh, so many big choices with no easy answers. In that way, you mean、That's、your mom? That's true. But actually,、you. I get lost really easily as well. I have no sense of direction. Oh, oh, oh so、okay. you get lost in the other way as yeah. well. Yeah.、Oh、okay. So here, the lost doesn't only mean lost, but it can also mean lost. But here, the lost doesn't only mean lost, but it can also mean lost. But here, the lost doesn't only mean lost, but it can also mean lost. But here, the lost doesn't only mean lost, but it can also mean lost. But here, the lost doesn't only mean lost, but it can also mean lost. But here, the lost doesn't only mean lost, but it can also mean lost. But here, the lost Be happy, 保持开朗的心 And there's more. There's more. Oh, there's more. It says the simple things in life can often bring the most joy. Oh, that's. What do you a, think? What do you think? That's a good bit of yeah, advice, right? Like, so, so the、happy. simple things in life, friends, a nice. 
conversation with your buddies,、yeah. reading a book at home on a cool, you know, night. That can be a really lovely thing. Just, It doesn't have to be、yeah. gold and diamonds and、Learn、expensive. Learn to appreciate small things in life. It can bring you a lot of joy.、Mm. True. 没错，其实就是我们要懂得知足。Okay, so 生活中最平凡的事情通常可以带来最大的。Joy, 喜悦 joy, joy. Word power, word. J O Y. It's a noun. Joy. What is joy? Joy is basically like great happiness. When you're really, really, really happy, and you want to just hug everyone. If you see a、uh, you know baseball players winning a big game, they'll hug everyone. They'll have big smiles on their faces. When families get together after not seeing each other for many years, you know you see those people at the airport, and their grandma comes through the door, and grandma, and they run over and hug her, and everyone's so happy. That would be a good example of the feel. Of joy, great happiness. Here's another good example. The children were full of joy when they received their gifts. The children were full of joy when they received their gifts. Maybe at Christmas time. Joy, my favorite character in Inside Out. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. just happiness, yeah. 就是喜悦，对不对？大家有没有看那个脑筋急转弯？开心的那个乐乐就是 joy. Okay, 所以刚刚提到是这个例句是当孩子们收到礼物的时候，当然怎么样 ？They're full of joy. 他们满心欢喜。Okay, so we got Laura's great message for her mom, or great、no? ideas about her mom.、No? Next, we have Elsie. Elsie says, "My mother inspires me." To help people all the time. That's a nice thing to do, and good for Elsie's mom. Yeah, so Elsie, her mom, encourages her to be constantly helping people. And then there's more. That's right. Help people all the time, and if you do that, Elsie says, we can change the world. By being kind,、so、if we're all、true. nice and kind to each other, the whole world will be a better place. Very, very That's true. That's true. We can use kindness, being kind, to change the world. No wonder she's always very helpful. That's right. That's、mm. right. Okay, let's move over to Pat. What does Pat say about his mum? He says, "My mother inspires me to be creative." Ah, good. Creative means he likes to make new things. I know Pat's a writer.、Uh-huh. He likes to write stories.、Mm-hmm. So. Maybe his mom also writes or makes music or paints or something. She does things that are creative. Yeah, like okay. Like an artist. Hmm. Our Pat 老师他说，我妈妈鼓励我要怎么样 ？Be creative. Creative 就是有创意的，或是有创造力这样子的意思。Hmm. So what kinds of things does she encourage you? Well, Pat, Pat tells us she encouraged me to read and play when I was a kid. And to use my imagination,、cool. and he still uses his imagination、yeah. today when he does his writing. So that is really good. Wow. Okay. Thank you, Pat's mom. So when Pat's mom, uh, is when Pat is a little child, she will encourage him to read and play, and to use his imagination, which means to use his creative imagination. Or encourage means to encourage. And we saw the word kid. That's right. Pat's mom inspired him when he was a kid. Kid is a word power word. K I D. That's right. Pat's mom inspired him when he was a kid. Kid is a word power word. K I D. It's a noun. Kid is basically just a casual, friendly, or less formal version of the word child. A young person is a kid. Generally, they'll be sort of teenagers or younger. So if you're, you know, seven, eight, nine, eleven years old, you might be called a kid, a child. For example, I want to be a kid again, so I don't have to worry about anything. I want to be a kid again, so I don't have to worry about anything. Except homework. I know. I want to be a kid again. So well, I don't. I don't know. Kids worry about a lot of things. Homework. Really. Studying tests. But they don't have to work. Their teachers. They don't have to go to work. They don't have to worry about money. Their parents. They have to go to school. They get money from their parents. A little bit. That's true. Yeah, That's true. Okay. I don't want to be a kid again. They worry about cleaning their room. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> okay. 好了，还是不要当个小孩子。Kid 其实就是 child. Okay, 就是小朋友这样的意思。K I D. 所以呢，刚刚的例句提到的就是我想要变回小孩子，这样子呢，一来我就不需要为任何事情烦心。不过刚刚 Mike 老师说的也没有错了，好像 kids 其实也蛮多的烦恼的、啊、，like homework or getting pimples，、mm-hmm. or, or, 长痘痘，什么嘟嘟。
豆豆，豆豆 ，That's right, pimples. Yeah, don't have to worry about that as you get older. Well, not so much. This, this is doo doo. Oh, well, that too. All right, let's move over. Let's move over to Angeline. What does she say? She says, "My mom is busy. Many moms are. Okay, my mom is busy, but she still takes good care of our family. Wow, sounds like she's super mom. She's got a job, and she also takes care of the family by cooking and cleaning and doing all that stuff. That's a lot of work, and that's something many, many moms do. So bravo for them. That's tough. 对呀，就是要工作的妈咪。所以 Angeline 就是说，她妈妈很忙碌，但是她仍然把我们全家照顾的很好。Take care of, okay, 就是照顾。So what does Angeline say? Well, Angeline sees how hard she works, but she still says, "I want to be just like her. I, I am inspired." To be a great super mom、She、like my mom. She wants to cook and work. Cook and clean. Have the family, the、yeah. husband, the job, the career,、great. all of that, and little sleep. You're gonna be great, Angeline. Absolutely. Okay, so Angeline 想要跟她妈咪一样的棒棒哦 Okay, now before we go to our review time, don't forget we have our magic box.、Ooh.